No one will throw it here. Pulled in. Butler hits it and miss. Another Iowa State first down. Nolan, a sophomore from just outside Athens, Georgia. Down the field. Caught. Butler breaks a tackle. Inside the 15. Keeps going. Highlight real touchdown. Sports Center top 10. Here we go. Going offensively. Iowa State says, no, sir. They find Butler on the scene. He breaks a couple tackles and finds his way to the end zone. Nolan, who played for his dad in high school just outside Athens, Georgia. Play action. Nolan taking a shot for Butler on the back shoulder. And Butler breaks another tackle. They can't get this guy down, and they can't catch him. Touchdown, Iowa State. By the Cyclones. The starting quarterback in his second career start, Zeb Nolan, throws a little back shoulder to the 6'6", Hakeem Butler. Making the most of it here in the second half. And they're on the move again inside the 40-yard line. Off play action, Nolan going downfield. And it's Butler again who makes the grab inside the 10. Guy's going to track it. I think now with the size you have on the perimeter, Greg, right. if he's even, your back shoulder to the sideline, and finally, We've gotten into the third quarter here. Finally, Zeb Nolan. Right now, Sheldon Crony's in the game on second and ten. Nolan has a wide open receiver and up and in as he dives to the goal line. It's Hakeem Butler. What's the ruling? Looks like he is into the end zone for an Iowa State touchdown. Get flipped here, upside down. But he's so long. In fact, Zeb Nolan said he's got the most unbelievable reach. And when you touch the pylon with the ball, that's a touchdown. Look at that hit by jo Jordan George on the play. Well, after going two for three on fourth downs last week, Iowa State with a fourth and five. Pressure coming up the middle. A throw and a catch. And it is a first down. And it is Hakeem Butler. Third and five. Akron's got to get a stop and get the ball back and Nolan is throwing and he goes to a team Butler and Butler ran just far enough on the route to pick up the first down as he made the catch just on the outside here watch the reach against George really stretching out for that ball Wow that is a catch running the football to be effective offensively Purdy saw the pressure coming, felt it, got out of the pocket, and let's see. Touchdown! Butler high points it beautifully. Talked about the basketball history with Butler. Here it is. And 6-6, and this was a veteran move. He didn't let Williams, the defensive back. Play really hard, and now we got to play and win with detail here in the second half. Thanks, Coach. Thank you. Matt Campbell, the head coach for Iowa State. Purdy down the middle. Butler got turned around and still yanked it in. Hakeem Butler to the 35-yard line. Demery. He hasn't played in three weeks. Beautiful. Touchdown! It's Hakeem Butler! The firm's response with the score and a suit of their own. Here it is, the switch route going underneath into the back corner. All it happens all the time. We see it. Guy's not been able to. Blitz again. Purdy lets it fly. In man coverage, Butler. Had another bye week to continue to prep. And now getting the start against Texas Tech. His team down by three. They have not had good field position. Purdy lofts one downfield, and it's caught. Hakeem Butler takes it to midfield and into Red Raider territory, but Butler is down. Purdy, clean pocket, looking for Butler. Broke it up, Butler makes the catch off the tip. Not watched both Butler and Wesley on the opposite side. You got to check out these guys' highlights. Johnny Lang in at running back. 
Purdy will throw. Downfield for Butler. Makes the catch. And Butler scores. A nine-point game. One-on-one -on -one coverage. And Phil's. Yeah, look, that's a that's a heck of a task there. Officially, they snap it at the 17. Play fake over the middle. Hakeem Butler. He's behind the defense. He's got speed. He's running away for the defense, and it's Hakeem Butler. Another big play for the big wide receiver for the Cyclones, who are on the board. And Lawrence, the speed, power component, and his ability to break tackles, what makes him special. They fake the handoff that time to Montgomery. They throw it deep, and it is Butler out jumping the defender, Hassan defense, and Butler finds the end zone for the second time in the first quarter. Out jumps Hassan defense, jumps right over the top of him. I mean, look, and then he just throws him out of the way. It's LeBron James in a football uniform. To Butler. Butler's got it. Wins this matchup against Devontae Davis. That one should stand. Five yards to Butler. Oh, that's a smooth now. And, and some people would say this is the Michael Irvin push there, that right hand to, to clear the way. What about the balance there to stay in bounds? Butler at the bottom of your screen. Purdy rolling out. Will reset and fire to Butler. P.J. Locke can't bring him down. Foster and company are there. And that is a huge pickup on second and 17 to set up a third and short. Purdy taking the deep shot. Looking for Butler. Butler holds it in. Contested by Chris Boyd. Butler showing why he is so good. Yeah, and it's got him on an island. And that's a great start there. He's wrestling, he's tussling, and that's about as good as you can do if you're Chris Boyd. A lot of beef on the left side. The pass to Butler. Touchdown. Six foot six, throw it up to him. Yeah, throw it where number six can't make a play on it and only number 18 can. Oh, rough times for the Red Raiders lately. You just saw Blake Seidler, his defense. Iowa State airing it out again. He does connect with Butler for 63. Down with the two that he didn't get the, play, the pass interference. Great job with play action there. They go right. Detail oriented, not just the coaching staff, the players have been. Second and 33. Who's open? Nice catch tumbling down. There is Hakeem Butler again, the Baltimore native. Themselves a lot. That is a freshman center, freshman quarterback making a rare mistake for the Cyclones. That is not their MO. Brock Purdy, the true freshman from Gilbert, Arizona. Hangs in there. Butler. Butler. Close, but he'll still be short of the first down, even after the 14-yard pickup. Stick it there at the end of the play by Neal, but here you go. You have Butler on a routine out route. He's able to get out, make some move. He moves better. Brock Purdy has been a part of this drought against Kansas State for no seasons. The precocious true freshman from Arizona lets it rip. It's caught again. Hakeem Butler. How do you defend the six foot six athlete? He gets behind the defense again. Plus his six six receiver here. There he is. He takes off. He's on him the whole way. He outruns Goolsby and gets over the top for another huge play. Looks like Drake for one of the few times. Oh, they are bringing pressure from the weak side. Blitz coming. Purdy gets it picked up, fires downfield, and Butler falls, but he caught it. He caught it inside the 40 yard line on his backside. Stomach. I don't know if I've ever seen a catch like that before. And Iowa State's going to go quickly. Hoping Iowa State throws the football so the clock stops on an incompletion. Purdy will throw it. Finds Butler. He hangs on for the first down. Big catch for Iowa State's big play target. 